In video five of our functional movement series, we're going to go over hip mobility. So anybody that has any type of hip impingement, looking to improve your squat mobility, or has any type of low back pain, we're going to go over three exercises for you to do using these rogue bands. So the first exercise, we have set up um, active hip flexion with the band causing a distraction towards the foot. So he's just going to kind of pull into the hip flexion, hold for 10 seconds, and each rep he wants to go a little bit further. Next, he's going to come onto all fours into what they call pigeon pose in yoga. So this is working more hip rotation. So again, the band is distracting and pulling that hip out, and he's getting deep into that hip external rotation. Hold about 10 seconds and do 5 to 10 reps and trying to stretch further into each position. Then we have Corey over here, and we're going to work hip flexion. So the most important part of this exercise is to make sure you're in a posterior pelvic tilt, and what that means is reduce the low back curve. This is then he's going to push and lean his hips forward. The band is pulling him backwards, and we're stretching the front part of that hip out. A great one for anyone with type of um, hip impingement with your squat. So there's three hip mobility exercises for you to try, and stay tuned for our next video. We're going to go over knee stabilization.